How you doing, brothers and sisters in Christ? What's the sign behind me? See it? it says 9-11. I'm at the 9-11 line. Came up this morning do, doing some hiking. Uh, hiking from the 1,000 line uh, over to the 910 line down to the 900. And here's the 9-11 line. I'm saying that for a very specific purpose. The sword is coming upon the land. We are to repent in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. There's not much time left to repent. I'm not talking to my brothers and sisters because they're already in repentance. I'm talking to the unrepentant. says in Ezekiel chapter 3 that we are watchmen and to warn all those who have not repented. If we see the sword coming upon the land, we are to warn the person. And if they repent, then they repent. If they don't, they don't. Blood's not on our head. So ultimately, what I'm saying is if you don't repent, the blood's on your own head. The sign behind me, 9-11, means emergency. There's a very, very grave emergency right now. 9-11. There was a 9-11 that happened. There's another one coming. There was a 9-11 that the government caused, that they blamed on terrorists. You know that? Hey, YouTube. Government's a bunch of cowards. They're planning on running underground when the crap hits the fan while we all die on the surface. You know that? Yeah, that's true. They're a bunch of liars. They're evil, vile, disgusting people that need to repent. And go to our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. You hear that, government? You hide behind your armies. Shed innocent blood. Shut the kingdom of heaven in men's faces. And you yourselves will not enter. Christ said the same thing. Woe to you, scribes and Pharisees, ye hypocrites. Because that's what you are, hypocrites. You say... You say, do, do, do one thing, but you do another. You, you, you say that we're supposed to obey all these laws, but you don't obey them yourselves. Thou shall not kill. You lie in wait for everybody's blood. And then you send innocent troops out to kill innocent people. They don't know what they're doing. They're just following orders. So I'm not one damn bit mad at them. Oh, but you bet I'm mad at you. I'm mad at the crap you do. Y'all need to stop this nonsense and return unto the Lord Jesus Christ. I don't care if you get mad. I don't care. You understand that? You will answer to God. And you will know He is the Lord. I don't care what y'all think. Five families. I'd say the five, five disgraceful families is what I say. Y'all are a disgrace. Who cares if you have or if you're billionaires? You don't got God. I could say that. Because you have not him. You think you do. Oh you you think you do. <laughs> y'all, y'all are so freaking arrogant and spiteful and just planning on just lying in wait for people's blood like you always have done, making 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 money off of people dying. Because you're, you're, you're war, war materials, ain't you? How, how do you say that? Uh, when, when the person makes money off of war. war a tearing or something like that? Making money off of war? That's what you all do, right? You sit behind, fund both sides. You think you got the whole world in your hands. No, there's one who's got the whole world in his hands. And that's God Almighty, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. 
Y'all, we're lint this world. Lint. And you're in a place of power for a specific reason. And that's to fulfill the negative plan of God. There's children of God. You know that? And we are. We are the children of God. And there is a God Almighty in heaven. And you will know it. Y'all will know it. Very soon. See the sign behind? 9-11? That's for y'all. That's my 9-11 to you. 9-11. Remember the one you caused? There's a 9-11 sign behind me for a reason. Now, my brothers and sisters in Christ, I love you. 